Hey, good morning everyone. Friday morning, 22nd of May 2020. A glorious day outside. Today, in our statement of strength, we have a look at the word courage. Anais Nin, who was a novelist born in 1903 and she died in 1977, said, Life shrinks or expands in relation to one's courage. The more courage we have, the more the picture of our life begins to expand. It gets better and bigger. A little story, I love telling stories, about the little red train that said, I could or thought he could. And for those who don't know, I'll tell it. So this little train is at the station and he's got all these other big steam trains around him. And they go up the hill and they brag how easy it is going up the hill. But pulling a heavy load, it does get a bit difficult. And to this little train, this appears to be a huge mountain to him. And he realizes it's going to take all of his energy to get up that hill. So the little train thinks as positive as what he can. And he starts off slowly, building up steam, all the while saying to himself, I think I can, I think I can, I think I can, and the momentum is building up, and the climb begins, and he chuffs up all the while saying, I think I can, I think I can, and as he nears the top, he goes, I think I can, and he gets to the top of the hill, and he says, I knew I could. I knew I could. And so it's the same with us. This morning, well, many people know that I enjoy my mountain bike. And this morning we went up to the junction. For those who don't know, it's a piece on the mountain here just above Camp Africa. And the climb up there is very, very steep. And it's much like this little red train. The little train that said, I think I can. I had to think I could get up there this morning and I had to be back in time to send this message to you as well. But when I was climbing up the mountain, your view changes. It comes, you suddenly start getting a different perspective. You start seeing a bigger picture. And so like with the little train, when he got to the top of the mountain, his view and his world got bigger and better. So, life shrinks or expands in relation to one's courage. If you stay at the bottom and think you cannot, your world begins to shrink. Perhaps we need to expand that picture. Scriptures teach us in Deuteronomy chapter 31 verse 6, God says to Moses, Be strong and courageous. Do not be afraid or terrified of them. For the Lord your God goes with you. He will never leave you nor forsake you. So, what about you? Do you allow your fears to hold you back? Do you look at the mountain and think, I can't do this? Well, has anybody told you you can't do that? Probably not. It's probably only you yourself that are convincing yourself very hard. I don't want to climb that mountain because it's a difficult climb. So do you allow your fears to hold you back and your vision also stays, suffers at the same time? Or do you step out in courage and climb that mountain? May the Lord be with you. May he bless you. May he cause his face to shine upon you and look graciously upon you. Amen.